It's officially Chargers week with the New York Jets preparing to face the LA Chargers on Monday Night Football. And both Connor McGovern and Wes Schweitzer, who were injured against the Giants, were placed on IR and Joe Tipman is still injured. So the Jets do not currently have a healthy center on the roster. Tipman seems like he's pretty close to being back, but if he can't play on Monday, it will likely be Xavier Newman that gets the start at center, assuming he is elevated from the practice squad again. Dwayne Brown is also close to coming back, and though he hasn't been great this year, he's still one of their better linemen, and it should be good to have him back. Brown also said that he feels like he probably came back from his injuries too soon earlier in the season, and so that probably impacted the way he played. The Jets also signed a former Pro Bowl offensive lineman yesterday in Roger Saffold, but did not make any moves at the trade deadline other than that. From what I've heard, it seems like Joe Douglas tried to trade for Devontae Adams or Mike Evans, but was not able to get a deal done. And the Raiders just cleaned house yesterday, firing their head coach, GM, and offensive coordinator. So that could be why the Raiders didn't make any trades. Zach talked to the media today and was asked about the Chargers and whether he feels like the offense is going to have to put up a lot of points to stay in the game. And he said he has a lot of trust in the Jets defense to keep them in the game, but he would also love to score a lot of points and hold the Chargers to not a lot of points. He was also asked about the possibility of Aaron Rodgers returning this season and how that affects his mindset. And he said that honestly, the thought hadn't really crossed his mind. Right now, he's just focused on one day at a time, trying to run the offense as efficiently as possible and win as many games as he can. And there's a lot of talk about Aaron Rodgers potentially returning this season, with some people speculating that he could return as early as December after his innovative new surgery. And personally, I think it's incredible that Rodgers is already dropping back to pass and throwing a football. And I'm not a doctor, so I have no idea when he'll be back. But I'm curious to see how the Jets would handle a situation where he's ready to play and the team is in the playoff hunt with Zach at quarterback. Aaron is obviously the better player, so it wouldn't really be about that. It would be more about whether the team wanted to risk putting him back out there behind a bad offensive line four months after he tore his Achilles. At the end of the day though, they traded for Rodgers for a reason, so if they feel like there's a chance to make a run in the playoffs, then they're going to take that risk. That's pretty far down the line though, and for that to even be in the conversation, the Jets need to win some more football games.